You know, life is hard. It, it's really hard. And many of us are searching for answers. We're looking for ways that we can better our lives, solutions to our problems, and ways to achieve our goals. And there's all kinds of things you can do to improve yourself and to improve your life, to get better at math, to get better at physics, to get better at programming, to find a job, to get in shape. There's all kinds of things you can do. But there is one commonality that they all have. And I think it's some, something sometimes we try to skip. And I wanted to make this video to talk about it because if, if you just focus on, on this one thing, it can change your life. And it's hard work. A lot of times people bash hard work. You know, I had this friend, he would always say, oh, people always just say, work harder, work harder. And it's true. People always do say, just work harder. But without hard work, you're, you're not gonna make it. You know, there's that old saying, work smart, not work hard. You kind of want to do both. You kind of want to work smart and work hard. You know, I used to have this job when I was much younger doing roofing. You know, I'd get up at five o'clock in the morning. I'd have my coffee, a big breakfast, and I'd get in the truck with my friend and we'd drive an hour in terrible traffic to go do roofing jobs. And it was hard work. Right, I was in the sun every day and I'm really, really pale, so I didn't make it the full year. And a job like that, you see, you see who the strong ones are and who the weak ones are. You see the people who are capable of hard work and the people who are weak and will not put in the effort. It's the same as mathematics, you know, as a math teacher, I've seen students that put in the hard work and, and students who don't. And I guess the message from this video is that you know, hard work is respected. If you work hard, people are gonna look at you and they're gonna respect you. The best students that I have ever had, in my view, aren't the ones that were good at mathematics. Sure, those were memorable and I'll never forget those. I've had students that have had incredibly deep levels of raw talent but it's the students that work hard the ones that rise up from the ashes like a phoenix and conquer and crush it students who could barely do any algebra and they somehow managed to get an a or a b in the class students who would spend eight hours a day studying i mean who does that those are the students I respected. Those are the students I admired. And those are the students I still think about. I'm getting goosebumps to this day when I'm trying to do something. I think of the students I had who were terrible at math. And I think about how much they struggled and how they never gave up. That's what people respect. And secondly, without hard work, you're never gonna, you're never gonna reach your goals. Sure, you might get lucky, but you have to put in the work, my friends. You have to put in the work. And yes, overdoing it is a thing. I think it's better to be consistent. You know, if you, if you just do a little bit of mathematics every single day, that's, that's certainly better than grinding for eight hours at a time and then burning yourself out, right? You definitely want to pace yourself and you want to focus on consistency. That is extremely important, extremely important. And I think that's the message for this video, right? Focus on hard work. Ignore the, the naysayers, like Arnold used to say, you know, the naysayers, those that say, you know, you know, hard work isn't the key. It is the key. It is the key. You have to put in the work. And I know it's hard. I know math is hard. I know physics is really hard. I struggled with physics, programming, statistics. So many people hate statistics. But when you put in the work, you will eventually get it. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow, maybe not next week, and maybe not in time for the final, right? But life is long, right? It's more than just about your grade in this class. You know, grades matter, but put in the work, my friends. Don't let people tell you that it's not about hard work.
just don't burn yourself out, pace yourself, and you know, focus on consistency. That consistency is, is what's gonna carry you, right? Anyways, I've talked a lot. Check out my courses. I've got math courses. They're on my website, mathsorcerer.com. They're actually on Udemy, but if you get them, please use the links from my website, mathsorcerer.com. I've got books, all kinds of books, math books, motivational books. Link in the description. Hard work. Hard work. You know, it just... And, and I, you know, I just, I was going to end the video, but, you know, I've seen it so many times, you know, because I've had so many jobs besides teaching, you know, I've had all kinds of physical labor jobs where you work with guys who, I don't know, like, they're like these tough guys and you put them to work, you know, pick up the shovel, pick up the piece of steel and you see that they break. If you can put in the work consistently, if you can work hard, you are going to outwork 99% of the people on this planet because... Most people don't have the drive or desire for whatever reason, right? Maybe they just don't believe in themselves. Maybe they don't believe that hard work is the solution. I think that could be it. I think people don't believe that if you work hard enough, you can reach your goals, right? And I'm telling you, you can, right? You can. You know, we look at all these people who have been wildly successful. You know, people always glamorize billionaires, people who have started major companies and they're super rich and... People think it's some some lucky thing. These people work hard. They're obsessed. And they're intelligent, right? They're working hard and they're working smart. And that's that's why they are where they are, you know? So don't dismiss hard work. Keep grinding. Do it every day. Believe in yourself. Believe in the journey. Believe that through hard work, you can reach your goals. You really can. And, and if, you're, if you're struggling with time, if you're thinking, well, you know, I already work really, really hard. How am I gonna find the time to work any harder? My advice is this, whatever it is you're, you're trying to focus on, whatever your priority is in life, do that first thing in the morning. So when you wake up in the morning, if, if you want to focus on your physical health, that's number one. If you want to focus on math, that's number one, right? And sure, there's studies that say, you know, you should work out before you do math and, you know, all that stuff. But I have found through experience and practice, whatever you focus on first, or at least early in the morning, that's, that's what's going to get you results, my friends. Work hard, be consistent, believe in yourself, and you can do anything, my friends. You can do it. It, it, it works. Stay strong.